Hi guys, it's Grace from Grace Gets Gastric, and I am here today for a new kind of video, which is a uh, August favorites video. So I actually got this idea from uh, Time to Shrink, VSG, which I'll link her channel up above. Uh, she's great. She is uh, pre-op, and she does a lot of keto stuff, um, and she does a lot of videos. She's really awesome, so you should check her out. But uh, she does monthly favorites, and I love the idea, and you know, I... And not one to pass up an opportunity to do a new kind of video so I thought I would do an August favorites um so this is a mixture of mostly kind of weight loss ish related things and then a couple of non weight loss things so the first thing I want to mention is uh, this big this is like the size of my head this big ass thing of um, calcium. So this is Calcimate Plus 800 with magnesium and D3. So this is from GNC and a serving size. So for 800, um, it's four caplets um, and it has 2000 IU of vitamin D, 800 um, mg of calcium and 100 mg of magnesium. So and then this is also calcium citrate. So um, I really like these. Um, because A, they're pretty small. I mean, you know, they're like the size of like a fingernail. So they're, I mean, they're not super small, but they're smaller than, a little bit smaller than the other calcium chews I've seen. Uh, I like that this is citrate. It has both, um, uh, magnesium and D3. So it's good to have balance your calcium with a certain amount of magnesium with this, which this has. Um, I think this whole thing for 500 was about um, like 30 something dollars. And um, it's got 125 days worth. I actually take six of these a day so I can get um, 1200. Uh, but I did the math and I should have written it down, but I didn't. But it's cheaper than what I was spending on my calcium chews. I got the Bariatric Advantage calcium chews. So it's cheaper than that. And um, it's not, it doesn't have carbs or calories like the other ones did. The chews did. So I've been really liking these for um, my calcium. I still am going to do some more research at some point to really do cost benefit analysis of the various ones, but so far this is a good option. And like I said, I got it at GNC. And they had like a buy, uh, they have a lot of deals often, like a buy three, get one free type thing. I didn't because I got this mega one, but yeah. <laughs> um, okay. Two, the next two things are kind of snacky related and they're kind of similar. The first is wisps, which if you know me, you know I love cello wisps. These are the bacon barbecue flavor and uh, y'all, these are delicious. Uh, the servings is, so for an ounce, it's 170 calories, 14 fat, two carbs, one sugar, 10 protein. So not quite as good in stats as the, the classic Parmesan. Um, but they're really tasty. They're a really great um, snack. They come in a smaller thing. I, I've seen them. You can get them at like Walmart. I actually got these at on um, net. Uh, not sorry, uh, bariatricpal.com because that's where I get a lot of my vitamins and stuff. And so um, usually they'll have like new things to try. And so I got these, and I'm really liking them a lot. Uh, the other snacky thing that I really am loving are the Max Barbecue Pork Rinds. Um, Mac pork rinds are amazing. Uh, the only place I've been able to get them around me is at Walmart. Um, and this barbecue flavor is legit. Now I'm really picky and I don't like spice at all. So a lot of the barbecue flavors I've tried by other brands, um, it's too spicy for me. The barbecue is like jalapeno barbecue or something. So these are not too spicy, which I love. The pork rinds itself are really good. And then just the barbecue they use is, is fantastic. So these are um, super tasty. Great snack. Oh, and for macros, for half an ounce, it's 80 calories, five fat, zero carb, seven protein. So pretty great. Um, I really enjoy these. I often have them at night. Um, I usually, like after I have my sweet treat, my dessert, I uh, crave something crunchy. And so having an ounce of these, 80 calories, it's pretty low, no carbs, uh, gives me a bit of protein and it's got that crunch. All right. Uh, the next thing that I am kind of obsessed with right now, and I've always enjoyed it, but particularly right now, is uh, cottage cheese. So I've mentioned this, I think, in one of my haul videos. Dairy Gold cottage cheese is the only cottage cheese 
I get. I don't mess around with those other ones. Every time I get a different brand, it disappoints. Uh, I really like the 2% low fat, uh, especially with the small curd. It's just delicious. Uh, so the stats for this, half a cup uh, is 90 calories, 2.5 fat, 5 carb, 4 sugar, 13 protein. So uh, cottage cheese has fantastic stats. I love this with um, seasoning salt and I often will pair it like pair like three or four ounces of it with um, an ounce of enlightened bean crisps or with cello wisps that I just like I just showed you um, for some crunch but I'm really liking this it's just it's tasty it's easy uh, and it's so hot here it's like nice for like a little bit of a cold snack so um, loving cottage cheese right now and then the next two are drink related. Um, I do, uh, I go through quite a lot of water enhancers. I drink, I would say maybe like a third regular water to two thirds water enhanced water. And my current favorite right now is the Great Value Energy Dragon Fruit drink mix. This is from Walmart and it is uh, delicious. It's um, got a little bit of caffeine in it which is nice. I have it sometimes in, like I'll have it in the mornings or like before I work out sometimes. And it's just, it just tastes really good. So this is like one of my favorites. They have uh, several other um, flavors that are also good, but this one is yummy. And then the last food related thing or drink, I guess, is almond extract. So if you have watched any of my what I eat in the day videos, I'll link the series up above. Um, you'll know that I have a protein coffee um, every single morning, so co cold brew usually with a protein shake. And I often will add some kind of flavoring with those protein shakes just for a bit of variety. Um, however, sometimes I find, um, so of the Premier Proteins, the chocolate isn't too sweet to me, so I find it fine to add flavoring, sweetened flavorings, but the vanilla is a little sweet, so if I add a, a syrup on top of that sometimes it's just too much so I've been enjoying adding uh, extracts to the drink so I get a new kind of flavor but I'm not adding any sweetness so lately my favorite combination has been the vanilla or sorry the, yeah the vanilla protein shake with the almond extract gives it kind of um, like an almond latte type vibe without any uh, extra sweetness. So uh, if you drink shakes, I really recommend playing around with extracts. If you go to like Walmart, they have a, a bajillion of them. Um, so I actually have a bunch of these, but the almond one, I keep forgetting that I, for a while there, I kept forgetting that I had almond extract. And so every time I'd go out, I'm like, oh, I need to buy some. So I have like five bottles of almond extract. So I've been going through a lot of it lately and it's really good. Uh, this next one is not a food item, but it is sort of weight loss ish or surgery related is um, this vitamin E oil. Yeah. You see, vitamin E oil, it's from Eden Samila, Sim uh, it's 3,500 IU um, and it's got organic rosehip and jojoba oil blend. I just bought this one on Amazon um, because I couldn't find where the vitamin E oil was in the store and I didn't feel like looking for it. So I just, I just found one. There's nothing necessarily special about this brand. Um, but when I went to my doctor, my surgeon's office, uh, on my six month post-op appointment, I just kind of casually mentioned, Hey, um, I've, you know, I've got the scars from the incisions. Is there anything that you might recommend to lighten those up? Uh, the scars don't really bother me. I was never super concerned about that. I intend to have plastic. So all that will probably be chopped up anyway. Um, but I was like, Hey, you know, if you have a recommendation, I'll take it. And she said the only thing that she would really recommend is vitamin E oil. So I bought some. I've been applying it for about a month very inconsistently. And it seems like it is making a difference. They do seem lighter. That could, There is no... I haven't been consistent. I didn't take photos. This is all... It could be placebo effect. Um, it could just be like natural lightning. So I cannot say for sure that this is working. But it does seem to be working. And I feel good applying it. So I thought I would include it. Um, when I, when I get, when I start getting close to like plastics time, I'm definitely going to be the, looking more into scar stuff just because those scars will be much more, um, intense, more extensive, more visible. All right. Um, so I have three more items and they're not at all weight loss related. 
Um, but they're things that I've been using and loving this month. So I thought I would show them. The first is uh, this Saint Tropez self tan bronzing mousse. This is like the little travel size. Um, it's a self tanner basically. I really like it a lot. Um, I don't use self tanner very frequently, um, but I have used it for a couple of events. Um, I went to a wedding uh, for my cruise. I don't um, tan. I, I mean like I'm a person who tans fairly easily, but I'm not often out in the sun. And I know, I mean, and when I am, I usually apply extensive sunscreen just because um, skin cancer, etc. I want to take care of my skin. So I like this self tanner. It works really well. It wasn't very streaky. It had a nice, um, nice glow, like a nice amount, I thought. And uh, it applied pretty easily. And it was kind of like a almost greenish color when it first came on. It's like a mousse. So it was easy to tell like where you had um rubbed it in already which I liked so yeah I applied this with the mitt and I really like it I would recommend I got this at Sephora the next thing is um this diva curl which is ultra defining gel stronghold no crunch styler um I'm not wearing it right now <laughs> so you know yay but you might have noticed in like the past month um because I, I put it in on Tuesdays after the gym and you might notice that my curls seem a little bit more voluminous and defined lately. And that is all thanks to this beautiful gel. I am obsessed with it. Um, I have this like combination hair that's like halfway between wavy and curly. And so um, you can kind of see now like they're, they're there, but it's like sort of a wave curl. Doesn't quite know what it wants to do. It looks okay. But when I put this in, it like kind of fully commits to the curl and it just gives me a little bit more definition. And so I'm a huge fan of this. I got this at Ulta. Um, you can also get it on like Amazon or other places, but uh, I definitely recommend. This last item, I actually just got this past weekend, but I'm already excited about it. It is a little coach wallet. I got it from the outlets and they were having a big sale. So this thing was like 20 bucks, which is awesome. And I actually have one that looks exactly the same almost. It's just different colors. This is, I've, and you can see here, it's like peeling and stuff. I've had this for like two, maybe two years. Um, and you can see I use it every day. Um, it's the perfect size in my opinion, because if I, I can fit it in a pocket, um, I don't bring my full purse to work. I have like a work backpack that I bring. And so, um, this is just like really convenient for me to, um, throw in. It's got enough space in it for my IDs, a couple of credit cards, um, all the relevant things I need. And then I also have like a main big wallet that I take with me if I'm gonna do like serious shopping, but this is really all I need. They're really cute. I really like the size a lot, just the slim fit. So I got a new one this weekend and I'm loving it. I'm very excited. I'm gonna transfer all my stuff over as soon as I'm done with this video. So yeah, those are my August favorites. This was fun. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, no, but let me know if you did enjoy watching this video and uh, if you'd like me to continue to make these every month, um, cause you know, I can do that. Uh, or if you have other, types of videos, ideas you have for me. Um, you know, I love talking to the camera now. I'm just like one of those people. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really did hope, I hope you enjoyed this video uh, and I will talk to you all soon. Bye guys.